Bella tips the rebound for Andrews, and she's off and running. Andrews scoops for Duarte, filling the lane for two. Pretty pass by Andrews, and the Hawks looking to run early. Kamara to inbound from underneath the basket, lobs it back into Ryan, tried to get the pass back to the corner. Bella got hands on it. Here's Andrews running the floor, gets into the paint, spins it up and in with the right hand. The defense from Abella leads to the layup from Andrews, her first of the day. Here's Putnam lobbing it up ahead. Glennon catches in stride and finishes with the right hand. Great vision from Putnam. Duarte comes to the top, hands it back off. Abella behind the screen, pulls up for a three and knocks it down. Third three of the ball game for Caitlin Abella. Andrews scoops to Glennon who lays it up and in. There's the 10th assist for Candace Andrews off the Glennon layup. Andrews looks for the high screen. Finds Abella at the top, turns into a three, and hits. Fourth three of the night for Caitlin Abella. Under a minute and a half to go. Hawks looking to just take as much time off the clock as possible here. Andrews lobs to Duarte, catches, goes up in traffic and finishes. And a new career high for Kayla Duarte now with 18 points. Yeah, I was really excited that our team finally kind of got our offense really rolling in certain spark, uh, parts of the game um, with some spurts uh, really in the second half. Uh, Candace ju does just such a good job involving everyone around her um, and finding, you know, finding teammates for layups in transition um, and then finding open shooters in transition too. Um, so I, I think she had a, a career best, uh, or maybe broke a record with 13 assists today and only four turnovers. I mean, she just she just makes everyone around her uh, better, and uh, and our offense just it flows through her. So um, I was really proud of her and how she composed herself and and how she played the game. Um, and then we had contributions from so many other kids too. Clary shot the ball well. Caitlin really shot the ball well. Um, she had 20 plus points and uh, and played pretty solid defense. And then Kayla had a double double. She would just own the boards on both ends um, and just ran the floor so hard and got so many transition layups. Um, I was just really proud of that group coming together and and uh, and beating a tough team. Yeah, we have a good test uh, coming up this Sunday. I'm so proud of our team though for you know putting together a body of work this season. Um, after going through some adversity in the off season, um, these kids just, they battled all year long to be, you know, 18 and nine. Um, and we actually beat AIC earlier this year at home. Um, so I'm excited to get another, you know, another chance to play them and play them in, in the Northeast 10 conference tournament. Um, it's just an honor to these kids to be able to make the tournament. It's tough to get into to our conference tournament. So to do that, um, it is is great, and I'm just really excited to see these kids battle another time and and see what they can do.